Everything looks different. This doesn't look like our school. It's weird that the teacher has not arrived yet. Yes, it all looks very different. Do you think we are in the wrong school? Welcome everyone to the new school. From today on, you will have to study very hard because I am the new teacher. How long have you been a teacher for? Since today. So get out your notebooks. We're about to start the class. No, 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 this can't be. I want our old teacher back. Me too. Me too. Bring back our old teacher. Oh, so everyone here wants the old teacher back now? Yes, everyone. I'm going to keep it in mind. You have to be happy that I am the teacher. Look at what I am. I am an excellent teacher. You are going to leave school as very educated people. I have faith in you. What a signature are you going to teach well, us? Well, as your first a signature, I was thinking to give you something that can be useful to you. I don't understand anything and you're spitting on me. But teachers have to give something that will be of use in the future of the students. What? Did anyone understand anything? Yes, he said recess. Recess. Sit down now. Here we come only to study. Do you want recess? You're going to have to pass the classes. The first class will be art. Let's see. I want you to show me something that represents you. Something that tells me you're a good artist. But I'm not an artist. Okay, but we are in art class now, so I need artists. Let's see. Who's an artist here? Anyone? Me. Let's see. Tell me something that represents you artistically. A flower. A flower? Yes. Well, please represent a flower with your body. This is art. Applaud. I can sing. And I imitate animal sounds like a horse. They're going to make me cry with joy. This is the class I've always wanted. Let's see what you've got. Can I go to the bathroom? Okay, guys, art class is about to begin. The flower girl, please come closer. I need you to draw me whatever you want. Here are all the paints. Let's see if you pass or fail the class now. A flower. And now I have to give it a little bit of color because this flower will not represent me if it stays this pale. Here we can see... Wait, 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 wait. Here we can see how she has clearly drawn a heart too. Which means that this artist has a lot of love in her heart. No, Professor. She drew it because she is in love with him. No, not at all. This is the flower that I was simply drawing with some color. This lacks love. And the stem with the leaf. I really don't think I can't actually grade this because this, it's horrendous. But it's got all the petals and the stem. The grade is going to be given by your classmates. So please guys, decide how we are gonna grade this painting. Rate the flower. I'm gonna be honest. I'll give her a candy for that, but no grade, nothing. Hmm, I'm gonna give it a five. I do want to go out with you tonight. I'm gonna grade it at zero. Oh, I'll grade it a zero, she says. This is the best flower you will ever see in your life. Now let's play a game. The one who catches the dinosaur is going to be the one who will draw the next picture. Are you ready? <laughs> yes, yes, yes! <laughs> you will have to draw the dinosaur. Okay. But no, 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 not with your hand. Using the dinosaur. Which part of the dinosaur would that be? That's like the neck. Blue, because it has a lot of blue. Okay. Oh no, this is real art. This is what I call an art class. Applause, guys. But professor, grade him with a zero because he didn't do the dinosaur. No, he's the dinosaur. Right now he's representing the dinosaur. Let's see, represent it. <laughs> this is art. All right, students, we finished our art at class and we're going to move on to science class. Let's see now, miss. Explain to me what this is here on the board. Well, it's very obvious it's a flower, but it lacks the stem and the petals. No, this is not a flower. This is an atom. You don't know anything. You'll have one less point on your final grade. Let's see, miss. Please explain to me what this is right here. Obviously a ladder. <laughs> How is this going to be a ladder? This is DNA. I can tell you all don't know anything about science. You know what? Everybody get to science class now. Let's go. But where is the science class? This way. Very well, my students. Now, it's time to study how atoms work. We are going to study molecules and systems. <laughs> here is a clear example of what an atom looks like. We are going to choose a student. Everybody come here. Everybody over here. Let's see. Duck, 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 duck. Duck, 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 goose. Yes. Get on! 
Are you ready? Because with this you will feel like an atom. I'm very prepared. Pay attention and see how the atom begins to spin. <laughs> you have to move it harder, Professor. Let's go. Yay, I'm not happy though. Fast, faster, faster. <laughs> and that's how the atom does its motion and returns out to its place. Now let's look at mental ability, the speed with which you function in the face of certain possibilities that life will throw at you. So I'm going to spin you and you're going to have to answer the questions for me, okay? What? So it goes how many days in a year? 365. What color is the flower of the sunflower? Purple! Ooh. Wrong! I'm going to spin you even faster. How much is one plus one? Two! Right here, clearly, we're observing how people think they start to think better when they're in constant motion. Now, let's take a look at the centrifugal force. Guys, don't forget about me. Guys. 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 Here we are going to see how the centrifugal force works. We're going to spin so fast, it's going to feel like we're inside a washing machine. It started spinning. Pay close attention to how we are spinning. This is going to get out of control. This causes a little bit of dizziness. Oh, so don't throw up. It's spinning a little hard. I can't promise you anything. And now you are going to pay attention to how the earth vibrates when a meteorite falls. How? <laughs> yes. That was great. Attention students, we are now going to study gravity. Let's see how much this guy can withstand in an earthquake. Like if the earth were to collapse, are you ready? Super ready. Let's start. Here's we can see how he's holding up. You didn't even last a second, you got a one. What do you mean a one? Yes, a one, you failed the class. What, you think it's easy? Of course, this is very easy. Try it then. No, I just can't because I'm getting a little old. I can't do it anymore. Try it. Watch and learn. This thing started to move. You have to feel the gravity. No, no it's just that I failed because of the waves. They were very strong. Of course, and so was the wind. Remember that I am giving away PlayStations, iPhones, laptops, and many other prizes. If you want to win them, all you have to do is like this video, comment on the word ready, and be subscribed to the channel. In other words, you have to press the subscribe button. I wish you all the best of luck. Don't forget to participate. All right, students, I have a question for you. Are you hungry? Yes. 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 That's the answer I wanted to hear. Because in this school, we eat. So we're going to do an experiment. We're going to try to make the world's biggest cotton candy. You come here, come here. Okay, here's the plan. We're going to turn this machine on and we have to try to make a giant cotton candy. What, but can I eat it? Obviously. Ah! Come on, let's go. Grab my hand. We have to do it together. And we have to do this. And spin. Come on, let's go. We can't rest. I think we are doing something. We are failing. <laughs> Gotta do another one. Gotta do another one. Oh, let's make a double one. Come on. Are there no instructions for this? No. Ready? Turn it off. Okay, okay. I think we... I think we did well. Perfect. Does it look good? It does. It has two hands. A body. Delicious. Since this was a failure, now we are going to mix them all together to see if we manage to make the biggest cotton candy in the world. But it with our hands? You want to do it with your feet? Okay, now grab them. And one... No, 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 grab them but not to eat because I see your intentions. Merge them. Merge them all together. Like this? Let's see if we can make the biggest one. There it is. Did it work? And now. Let's eat. Eat it. <laughs> no. No. Cotton candy war. No. I... I ended up winning. Behold, the greatest chocolate fountain. Ooh. I... <laughs> mm. It is finger licking good. Everyone will be able to take whatever food they want and put it in the fountain. I'm going to grab a stick of marshmallows, a kiwi fruit, and a chocolate. Oh, yes. I also want some... <laughs> no? Mm. It is very tasty. Anyone want some? We better go play. Vamos a jugar.
vamos a jugar, vamos a jugar. Guys, look, he fell asleep. Let's pull a fun prank on him. You can't sleep in here. This is the big rest area. We have beds, we can rest, and we can relax over here. But not right now, because now we are going to... Let's see who can pop the most balloons with only three tries. Okay. And let's start... Second try. Now it's your turn. One. Two. Three. He is the best of my students. The one who has learned the most. So learn from him. Watch and learn how to play. There is one condition in this game. If you shoot from here, it's nine points. From here, six, three, and one point. From where do you want to shoot? From nine. Ah, a determined woman. I am the best here. Don't be so smug because if you don't get it right, I don't know what kind of face you'll make. No, I am not smug. <laughs> the basket moved. The basket moved. Watch and learn. The basket has moved. Watch and learn from the winner. The wall moved. The wall moved. See how it's done. The basket moved. It's my turn again, because I I'm the best. No! Who was it? The one who threw the ball at me? It was him. Him. Come over here. To pass this class, you are going to have... You have to hit all the balls in one shot. If you don't, you won't pass the class. Okay. No, 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 no. You're so funny. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> and now, let's go down the slide. <laughs> Hurry up. <laughs> we arrived at the laboratory. In this place, we are going to do and witness the greatest experiment done by humans so far. So, stand back please. And watch a little hydrogen peroxide. That wasn't a little, you emptied the whole bottle. A little bit of detergent. And now the key ingredient, a little yeast with water. Mix and wash this now. You observe. <gasps> And now I challenge someone to do better than your teacher. Let's do an experiment, man. First, let's grab our glasses. These are used to protect our eyes. Then let's grab this mix, which has a little bit of baking soda, plus some sugar. Let's add some alcohol. And watch. Fire. I understand it's fire burning, but I don't understand what the experiment is. It is called the Black Mamba. It is a charcoal snake. It's a charcoal snake. How interesting. No. The Mamba. You failed. Ooh. You didn't beat the teacher. I'm going to analyze now what your grades are. Okay. Everyone failed. No. no. Yes, everyone failed. No. Goodbye. You're a lousy teacher. You get out. Help me get him out of here. Get out, get out, get out. You're all leaving my school. 